How are we doing today? Um, I actually wanted to talk a little bit about uh, a couple cards that I found when I've been offline. Um, the These specific cards I've been collecting, the one with the giant numbers, if you can see them, 88, uh, 28, 83, 54, and 83. Those, those, for some reason, always catch my eye. I love them. Um, Zach Thomas is, and Fred Taylor are the ones that I uh, kind of recognize the most. But um, that was really cool. I keep all my signed car, signed albums. If you look, not signed albums, but signed uh, cards. If you look, these are my collections of ones that I, I collect. One thing I found was this card right here. It was an Anthony Gonzalez card. And where is he at? Oh, right here at the bottom. Anthony Gonzalez. Um, that was a great buy, a great find the other day. Anthony Gonzalez, he played Ohio State football. He actually had one of the all-time uh, great catches versus Michigan. Ohio State was down by about four or five points, and they only had like 60-some seconds to go, and Anthony Gonzalez just made this circus catch. <laughs> it was awesome. So just getting a card like that, and yeah, pretty much I was in heaven. Um, and I, I remember telling you guys about snow day cards these are my snow day cards they have different ones um levion bell juju smith um marilyn mack von miller it's just a collection and i got to actually add two of that collection with a box i opened the other day um it had uh matthew stafford in it jordan howard it's just, it's just a really cool way of how they do that. Um, it, it's just a collection, and I don't know exactly know how many there there are. It does look like around twenty cards because I don't see a number higher than twenty. So if I can try to get all the twenty cards, that would be awesome. So, but anyways, let's get down to the business of matter here and open up some football cards. All right, here we go. Ah. Let's see here. So the first card up is Antonio Brown. I already looked at him. I have oh, I have almost two sleeves full of Antonio Brown. It is very awesome. I I've said this story before. He was homeless when he was a younger kid, and he turned his life around. He pretty, I think, pretty much walked on uh, from uh, Central Michigan, and he was a nobody. And then he ended up being a somebody. He was one. Of, he's one of the well-known best wide receivers in the NFL. He's he's leaving Pittsburgh, but still, I mean, just just that story behind it. It's like. You know, you can do whatever you want if you put your mind to it. And and I believe, don't don't quote me on this, but he went to Central Michigan on a scholarship for his intelligence. So what, what do they call that? Uh, a full ride scholarship for academics. So this is my this is my Antonio Brown card. Very shiny, very hard, very just glossy. It's just one of. It's, I can't believe I have it, and I'm very happy I do. Um, so that's what's going on with the cards. And I have another one, Ted Johnson. That's a good card, Ted Johnson. He played for UCLA. That's a that's a pretty neat card. Um, John Stevens is a star. It says it's a super rookie card. He played his college days at Northwestern L.A. State. I don't even know where that is. Terry Allen, Terry Allen. He he's he's a he's a Clemson grad. Just a nice card. I'll be keeping that one for sure. Um, let's see here. Uh, I, I like I like when they do this double vision thing. It's actually it's actually a college card. Double vision. It's got two 
it's a Penn State and a Colorado. Rasham Shalam, Rashan Salem, and Kai Jenna Carter. Which the first one really sounds familiar, but I really like that card. I like it. Uh, Mike Ken. It's an action pack card. Gotta love these. Um, so here we go. Curtis Martin, star rookie. Curtis Martin. Um, it's a rookie card for the Giant, uh, for the Patriots. So I always love to keep rookie cards. Oh, this is very cool. I don't have this card. I'm pretty sure I don't have this card. This is a uh, Harry Ellard. Ellard. Um, this is one of the art artistic cards that an artist drew and if you can see it's got he played for the LA Rams so they have a Ram right there <laughs> that is very cool cannot wait to add that to my collection um, oh that's a very good card Tony Dorsett Tony Dorsett is one of the the Hall of Famer he's gonna be he he is just uh, he was a powerhouse he really was uh, let's see here Kevin Boss, you know I have I have some of these cards and I can't wait to add that to my collection. Uh, Larry Centers, another well-known name in football. Uh, Mike Johnson for the Browns, another well-known name. Uh, Jim Kelly, yeah, I don't Jim Kelly or Phil Sims. One of them just beat cancer. I don't know which one. I should really I I, I will actually find that out before. The next video, so the next video I can actually tell you guys which one it is, but it's pretty cool to know that I have a card with a guy that just beat cancer, you know what I'm saying? You know, so, oh, we got a hit, we got a hit. Uh oh, I'm kind of fuzzy with it too. So I have a wide receiver, Kim White. I can't say his name correctly, but if you can tell right here, he signed it. It is one of the, uh, one of the cards that has been signed, and I am so happy of that. I am literally going to put it away right now. So when I get a card that's signed, that's what I do. I open it up. Hopefully I don't have it. Nope, that's one thing I do not have not ran into is duplicates of people that have signed cards. Very cool. Just added it to my signed collection of cards. I love it. Okay, we are still going here. Still going strong. Um, Kevin Turner for the for the Eagles. Nothing too special there. Mark ba Bavaro. Bavaro. Mark Bavaro for the Titans. Hope to God I'm saying that name right. Deuce Staley. Deuce Staley. From the um, from the Eagles. Oh look, I got another Pro Line card. This is this is the cards that I'm collecting. I love the. <gasps> oh my God, it's a Warren Moon. Oh God, this is a great find. Holy cow, I didn't even notice it was him. This is not even going in my collection. I'm sorry, I'm going into my collection of Warren Moons, which is over 30 right now. God, I can't believe I just found that. That was awesome. Okay. Boomer Seisman, I got another collection card. Very cool. Gaston, Gaston Green. That is a funny name just because uh, only me and my girlfriend would get that. Um, here is Gaston Green from the UCLA. Okay. I just cannot find, I just can't believe I just found a Warren Moon card. Okay, sorry. John Taylor. John Taylor. I don't know if this is the John Taylor that I'm used to, but he played for the 49ers. So, I'll be keeping that one. I don't know. I'll have to look that John Taylor up and see if it's the same Taylor that I'm thinking of. Or maybe he's related to, um, he's related to Fred Taylor. That would be cool, right? So, here is Kell Kellen Winslow. Kellen Winslow, I'll give you some uh, background on this guy. Kellen Winslow, his son played in the 2002 National Championship Miami versus Ohio State. Kellen Winslow was a monster, a tight end, such a fast tight end. He wasn't considered too much a tight end on the field because he was so quick. He was, it's like, it was hard to cover him because he was big and he, he had hands. His hands were huge. So this is a very cool card. And I didn't know. Calvin Winslow Sr. actually played for the Browns. Wait a minute, is this? 
You know what? This is actually his son, Kellen Winslow, but his dad actually played too. Yeah, so I'll have to keep an eye on that. Ty Dentmer. Here's another uh, Cleveland player. So, so here's a Cleveland player, Ty Detmer. Uh, I will be keeping this. It's just a good knee card. Sorry. So I don't know what to tell you on that one. Uh, Greg Bell for the Bills. Robert Wilson for the Buccaneers. Keith Sims for the Miami Dolphins. Corell. Col Corell. Germain. Uh, for the Lions. Cedric Houston for the Jets. I'm sorry, nothing's going to get better than that Warren Moon card. Even that signed autograph card isn't as great in my mind as that Warren Moon. Ugh. Ted Brian Opica from Texas. That's, a, that's my first college card I've gotten. Nice. I was wondering if I was going to get any college cards there. Um, okay, so we're going off to the next half of the card card deck. Uh, first card, Dwayne Bates. This is just a really nice, shiny looking, beautiful card. Keeping that one for sure. Uh, Chris Chandler. Chris Chandler, he is, man, you know, Chris Chandler's total career passing yards was 20,865. That is pretty cool. I like that. I'm, that's, that's just neat to see how much a uh, person ran or passed past. Sham Salem. See, a Sham Salem. Remember that name? Guess what? I just got his pro card. I'll have to for sure uh, keep an eye on that one and look for it. Okay, let's see here. Ken, who is this guy? Ken Harvey. Ken Harvey for the Redskins. Okay, uh, let's see here. Chris Warren, uh, Richard Brown <laughs> for the Browns. That's funny. Rodney Pete. You know what? I'm starting to collect these Rodney Pete cards. It's kind of a neat. I don't know. I like them. You know what? I'm actually going to put them over there. Uh, let's see here. Chris Warren. That is actually a duplicate duplicate. Thomas Smith for the... Oops, sorry. I'll show you. Thomas Smith for the Tar Heels of North Carolina. I like that. Uh, Carl Thomas. Okay. Just going through some. Rod Smith. This is a card I'm starting to collect. I'm starting to get a lot of Rod Smiths. Smiths? I don't think I said that right. L. Wilson for the Broncos. Oh, look, look, it's like too funny. Rod Smith, you know, that's what I like about these decks. This is 75 cards. Not 75 cards of the same style, same era, same patterns. It's different ones every time. And I just got a Rod Smith, and here's another Rod Smith. I like it. It's a different style. It's a different look. Can't go wrong there. Desmond Clark. Oh, that would have been that would have been super cool. If that would have been Desmond Howard. John Taylor. Billy Joe. Sorry, not going to. David Little. He was a great, great middle linebacker. Let's see here. A kicker. John Kitna. John Kitna played for the Lions, and he played for a couple other teams. It's just a neat card to have. I like John Kitna. I will be keeping John Kitna for sure. And the last two cards, Charles Wilson. Where did he play at? Oh, Memphis State. Okay, Charles Wilson for the Green Bay Packers. And the last two are just copies that I've had before. Okay, so what a great find today. I got an autographed card and... Oh, Got a Warren Moon. Can't go wrong there. What a great box. If you like my video, subscribe. And guess what? I'll be back soon.